as if the evidence isn't literally damning enough, we just got a privacy takedown from YouTube regarding the Hallelujah Scriptures. And this is what it says. Hi, Yahoo and the Torah. This is to notify you that we've received a privacy complaint from an individual regarding your content. And this content was the content that was, um, this was the house. And so this showed the house that was being sold on 3396 Panther Lane. And I guess we can no longer speak the truth at all anywhere on YouTube. So I guess this is now a video that is gone. However, you can still find it on the other platforms. And this is completely understood. And we know why they're doing this, right? And so they're hiding their trail. They're hiding their tracks. But this is never, ever going to get me to stop. And I'm going to be calling when I have my case file done. I will be calling the FBI once a week for the rest of my life until they investigate into this criminal activity and take this case file that I have and do something about it. Because we got to get to this house. We got to save the people who have so, who donated so much and these people have extracted a house out of them. And so I guess if this is violating YouTube, YouTube's uh, terms and conditions, I'm, I'm super sorry. I, I can't, I don't know why telling the truth is such a crime anymore, but <clears throat> let's finish off with this. We would like to give you an opportunity to remove or edit private information that might be pre present within the content reported. This notification informs you that another user has raised a privacy concern about your content. However, it will not automatically result in your video being restricted and has no associated penalty has been applied to your video at this time. We'd like to give you an opportunity to remove or edit the private information that m might be present within the content reported. After 48 hours of this notice, we will review the complaint for violations of our privacy guidelines and consider restricting the content. And so um, this is, um, I'm going to go ahead and take this video down. I will comply with YouTube's terms and services. And, um, but guys, how much more evidence do you need? Let's take a look at the second one they just sent. And so this is the other one right here. And so we have yet another one came in at 3.44 p.m. And um, this one it identified the people of, that are complicit with this, the people that have been hiding for the last 10 years and the people that are going to be reported to the FBI. And in the world of truth, they can ban all these channels. They can do whatever they want. Um, I just want the truth out. I want the people of our, our creator not to be rickrolled and rolled over over and over and over again it's just it's ridiculous and so we need to come to terms if we are under the torah and we are keeping the law then we need to be able to convict those who are selling the torah under the law as such and they're breaking at least 10 commandments that i can count probably way more if i go through it so guys um keep your eyes open understand who you're dealing with much love i'm out